If you don't wanna treat it right, I will. If you ain't gonna be the right, I will. If you don't wanna make a Hey, what's up my cochinos and cochinas? Welcome back to another mukbang eating thing, food review kind of deal thing I got going on. So what today we're gonna do is some fucking um, nacho fries supreme. Now the last time I had a nacho fries video, it's, it was like the nacho fries box. So today we're just doing the supreme. This shit costs $2.50, it's not really that big. So it's not gonna take that long for me to eat it. It comes with fucking french fries, like the seasoned fries, some fucking um, nacho cheese, ground beef, tomatoes, and sour cream. So let's go ahead and take um, some of Taco Bell's famous hot sauce and pour this shit on. I'll try not to eat it too fast. I'll try to talk to you guys um, and let you know a story. Um, of one time I was helping build a huge gold bell out of all gold um, and installing that shit and how I broke some bones. So hopefully that story will help me prolong eating this because this really isn't a lot and if I was just eating it regularly and not talking, I'd get done really quick. So We're going to go ahead and pour the hot sauce on this bitch. Um, this video might only be like 10 minutes, but that's cool. I know I respect your guys' time. And like I said, all I got is this mini ass fucking french fries. Also, we got the tapatio on deck. Yeah, I know it looks small compared to the big one I usually have. But let's go ahead and get it bloody. Alright. And then also, got the side chick Valentina. She wants a little bit of the fun and the action as well. So, now, you guys go ahead and check it out. That's how we eat it around here, you know. Got me some fucking uh, soda. Uh, got the um, motherfucking jailhouse spoon. Ready to go. Had plastic on it and shit. All right. So let's just get straight to it. No time to be wasted. No further fanfare, BS. Or stalling. Let's go ahead and just get to it. Mm. You know the funny part? As I said, mm, before I even had tasted it. You know, I trust Taco Bell. Me and Taco Bell don't have any trust issues. We go way back. I don't think I've ever went to Taco Bell and ate something and thought, damn, that shit was nasty. Pretty much everything I've ever eaten from there is good as fuck. Now, there's some stuff that's just average, but overall, we don't have any trust issues. Mm. I would def definitely recommend you guys trying these out. Um, if you have the money, I would get like you know, two, maybe three. If you have a real big appetite, get four of these. Spend 10 bucks, you know, get a container or a plate at home. Put them all on there and have you a nice big ass fucking, um, you know, platter of fries, of uh, super fries. So anyway, let's get into uh, what you guys came for. Besides the food, this shit looks small as fuck, huh? Uh, there's this one time I was in Germany as many of you know I usually help out with building things and shit you know it's I don't want to say it's construction because it's I mean it has construction to it but that's not my main thing I do a lot of uh, what should I say like creating and, and uh, like planning out different shit you know a lot of like drafting and shit like that so anyway There was this, I'm kind of like a church area, but it was in the middle of a plaza, and they wanted to install a huge ass bell there. But they wanted this bell to be pure gold. So, anyways, we constructed that thing. Okay, let me put it like this. I was in America, and I knew that we could construct it here. It might be a little bit easier, but it's better we go there so we don't have to ship it. So we go to Germany, me and my team, and we get a hold of the gold supplier. 
and let them know how much we need. That's neither here nor there. I'm giving you guys all the boring details. Anyways, we got all we needed. We built the bell. Then we um, got a truck because we needed to transport the bell to the center so that we can install it. And this takes about a team of about eight people, including myself, so about seven other people. So we get there, and we had to use a small crane in order to help install it. Now, it's kind of hard to give you a picture of how we install it or what it was hanging from. It was pretty much from like a ceiling. Um, it's like a concrete kind of ceiling that they had built. It has like spaces in between it. Um, but it was pretty solid to be able to hold um, the bell. And there's like a little loop for us to be able to connect the bell to. Kind of hard to explain, but anyway. We ended up installing it. We got the crane, got the crane operator. You know, let them know exactly what they needed to do when we had that shit. Um, I got stalled, right? And that's not the issue, because you're like, if you, how'd you break a bone? Did this fucking heavy-ass bell fall on you? No, it didn't. We actually installed the bell, and everything went just as planned and was successful. So we're leaving... We'll crack open some beers. We're celebrating because the project's done. Now this plaza, not that far, is kind of connected to a community. So this fool runs out of his house. This German fool just jets out of his house. And then I hear some lady screaming. I'm like, what the hell? I walk past the, the, uh, the door and full force is this heavy set German lady running, cursing and shit. She knocks me over. And I fucking break my ankle. I was like, what the fuck, honey? That shit hurt. I had to go to the hospital and shit. That shit was annoying as fuck. <clears throat> I was like, you go, you go all the way to another country. To do a heavy job, kind of. And you get hurt, not from your job, but from some random fucking accident, some random mishap, some, you know, Vato and his lady arguing and shit. This woman was like 300 pounds, bro, maybe 350 pounds. Just as tall as me, too, like 6'2". She, she's probably like 6 foot, but still. She was a big woman, man. I'm like, man. And that Vato was skinny as hell. That fool was out. Oh shit. Says I only got four minutes left <clears throat> on my SD card. Anyway, we're almost done anyway. Let me know below if you've ever broken a bone and how it happened. We made it this far. Go ahead below and say you love big German women. <laughs> or or you can say that Vato was fast hey, this is on hit I ain't even right this is really good I'm almost a little sad that there's not more I think about three of these would be perfect appreciate you guys let me know in the comments below if you heard of some new um, stuff coming out that you want me to try out or some recipes that you want me to fuck with uh, let me know um, remember to subscribe because I do live mukbangs and well actually I do more live drinking events than I do mukbangs but either way I go live so make sure to be subscribed hit that like button leave your comments below and until the next time all right if you don't want to treat it right I will if you ain't gonna be the right I will if you don't want to make a wife, me and her gonna take a flight, have a dinner in Hawaii, me in a suit, tie her in a tight dress and high heels, publicly tell her how I feel, never be ashamed to give her my last name and take away her pain because I'm real.